South Korean households are facing increasingly tight financial conditions as the amount of money left over after tax and spending on necessities such as food has been steadily declining for the past two years. According to data released by Statistics Korea on Monday, household discretionary income decreased by 1.7 percent year-on-year in the second quarter of this year to reach a monthly average of just over a million Korean won, or that's around 750 U.S. dollars. This marks eight consecutive quarters of decline, the longest run since data first began to be compiled. The primary reasons for this downward trend are soaring inflation, rising interest rates, and stagnant wage growth.